Today we're trying out the brand new crazy RU tier with Pokemon like Thunderous, Tyranitar, Iron Jugulus, and Gyarados, just to name a few. Let me know your guys' thoughts on the new RU tier. If you didn't see my video covering everything, I uploaded that yesterday. Make sure you go and check that out. And I built this team in like five seconds, so it's not going to be very good. But again, I'm just kind of figuring out what's in this tier, how does this go, and how do I... Uh, I don't want to play versus it, so there's a Tyranitar lead. I have no idea if they're running Bandit, if they're running Choice Scarf yet, or even if they're just running Rocks, as obviously they get up Rocks there. So we'll explode immediately on this, get some nice little chip, and we're going to try and win. Uh, guys, if you do enjoy this video, make sure you let me know, by the way, by leaving a like and subbing to the channel. As I'm on my way to 400k, that's my end of the year goal, and this team will be on my website, Pokemon.com. Now, how the hell do I want to knock this mod out in one hit? Uh, honestly, Jugulus is crazy in this game, but just by itself, I'm gonna use it. I'm literally going into it right now. And I'm just clicking Focus Blast. And if this doesn't kill, I'm gonna make it Terra Ground Earth Power instead. But I mean, look at their team and look at Jug. Honestly, Terra Ground Earth Power would be better in this game. Like, all this coverage. I'm really not sure on the the correct way to play. Damn, T-Tar. You're a damn threat, huh? It's fine. The way I'm gonna win this game is with my own Tyranitar. I'm Terra Fly, Terra Blast, and look how crazy it goes. It sets up and it just straight up wins. So go for Grass Knot as they Terra Ground, thinking I'd Thunderbolt. Thank God I didn't, even though I was wanted to. So they wasted their Terra. I'm in a good spot. That means every single time I hit one of these Pokemon, I'm gonna be hitting these Pokemon for their typing. So we're in a pretty good spot. I'm also Citrus Berry on my T Tar, which makes a, a big difference, I think, in this game. Uh, I'm nasty plot up. They shouldn't be able to kill me in one hit. Yeah, we're good. I guess they could get the quick draw, quick everything. But we'll see what happens. We'll see. Perfect. Oh, their AV as well. Okay. Okay, no problem. It's time. Forget everything we've done. And now to win with Tyranitar. Perfect. Hmm. Do I Dragon Dance a second time? Do I need to? I feel like I KO every mod on their team. I'm pretty sure I KO every mod on their team. So I'm just going to go right for the Terra Blast here. I don't want them Leech Seeding. And this should be game. They already terra They can't beat anything? Unless it's random Scarf on Slitherwing, I, I should be good. I definitely KO Arcanine right here with Stone Edge. Maybe they pivot. Oh, or I just miss and get burnt. Very unfortunate. So that's the first one. <laughs> and it does 50. Okay, so it wasn't even gonna... Oh, and they crit me as well. That's perfect. I can still win the game with Mimikyu though, so that's not the end of the world. Oh, Stone Edge again just because it hits their entire team hard. I'm gonna go Lumberry. I didn't realize I'd fight a Willowisp Arcanine. I like Citrus just because I was taking Sandstorm damage, so I figured it'd be cool. He gets some recovery. So the wind comes out. We'll let them first impression. I think I SD up as well and, and win the game. <laughs> pretty sure I just win. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I win right now. I had Mimikyu, I had Ditto because I wanted things that can deal with annoying Mons on their team. I don't think you're very bulky at all, so I'm gonna knock you out with this. Yep. That should be game. Shout out to Mimikyu. I'm going for this just in case they have quick draw though they're assault vest for sure but you know and they're also regen <laughs> and then we'll just hit this thing up with uh, a shadow claw and that should be game because we have this thing in the back all right so decent first game tyranitar was pretty solid here uh, i'm gonna keep the lumberry on it going forward and obviously them using their terra again this is we're, we're just testing out the new tier so we have no idea how it's actually gonna be i think what i want to do though is make this terra terra fighting wouldn't be bad right I kind of like the idea of Okoing Tyranitar in one. So I'm going to try Terra Fighting on that. And then we'll get another game. We'll be right back. So my opponent's team is pretty slow. But that doesn't mean they don't have any threats. Like, they, they have a, a billion threats. But this is a lead Azelf team. So, Dancy lead. Get on my hazards there. Jeez, they tried to sweep me from the get. This mod's actually a giant threat to my team. Please don't get the defense raised. Okay. I was like, this mod is actually a giant threat to my team. Holy crap. Like, it's really good into my team. I can go Thunderous, Terra Steel, but then um, I don't get to hit them with Tyranitar later. Hmm. I think the play is to go Mimikyu and just set up alongside them. Because I can beat Gyarados via my own. And they're not getting these raises, so I'm going to go for Player Rough. And I'm going to land. I've decided. I'm landing. Instead, of, I'm not going to Shadow Claw for a 2-8 KO. I'm going to Play Rough for a 2-8 KO. Or Oko. Perfect. Yeah, because Shadow Claw would not have KO'd. So that's a giant threat. I got very lucky, though. 250% chances that my opponent didn't get any of them. This demon comes out. You can get this play rough too. I mean, if this actually KOs, yeah, I'm about to say, if this actually KO'd, it could have been oval. It could have been straight up oval. Hmm. 
Thunderous. They would have to be Terra Ground to not get hit by Thunderous. And then I just sweep them with Waterfall from Ditto. Okay, so we'll go this. There's no Custat Berry at the moment, unfortunately. So we can get a KO right now with Thunderbolt. Maybe they'll end up bringing out Chestnut, which actually hard walls me. Maybe not. Let me see if I can Nasty Plot and just brute force through this thing. I'm going to get another one up. Unless it's a sub. I don't want to Focus Blast because of their ability. That did a lot. That did a ton too. Hold up. If none of their mons are Scarf though? Oh, of course you're Spiky Shield. What is this set? What is this set? <laughs> However, I'm looking very, very, very good with Tyranitar. So hit him with a Fire Blast here. Get my KO. Then we'll Dark Pulse versus uh, Gyarados because they can't kill me in one hit. So we Dark Pulse. It's okay. I want them to get Dragon Dances so I can sweep them back with this because it's, it's literally a, a 6-0 if I do. Hmm. They've already... They haven't Terrored yet. So I guess they could become... They could become a Grass type or Armor Rouge. But this should be game, I think. Did I just hit this thing as well? Oh my god. Jug is crazy. Jug is insane. Jug is actually wild. Alright, so... We go you and we just uh, dra uh, Terra, just so we don't take super effective damage, take a ton. And then we can hit them with the Terra Blast Fly on Armor Rouge, just in case they Terra Grass or some crap. It also just doesn't miss, right? Like, there's very few Terras they could have that would beat me from this position, especially because I copied them with Ditto. Yeah, they Terra Steel. I guess Steel would have been one of them. Hmm. No, I win. Just click Aura Sphere. Perfect. So, like, after that game, I kind of just want to go back to Terra Dark, right? Because uh, you saw, like, the Dark Pulses with a 2 a killed Gardevoir. Obviously, I got a flinch, but you saw it with a 2 a killed Gardevoir. So, we'll go back to Terra Dark on this one. To be honest, though, I kind of want to get rid of this and go Hurricane, Terra Fly. Because that's the biggest damage. I just really freaking love this set. Like, I really, really, really love this set on Jug. Also, I'm a huge fan of offense on when a new metagame drops, so... Yeah, what are you guys' thoughts on RU so far? It's been about a day since it'll be uploaded, and uh, we'll go look for another game. All right, we got one versus an Azelf team. I'm leading off a Tyranitar in this one. They could also do the exact same thing, to be honest. Um, I know this is Blunder's team. Wait one second. Okay, anyway. Uh, maybe I just lead Azelf and try and win a speed tie, to be honest. Because, like, my way, like, look how good Iron Jugulus is in this game. And obviously, I have Mimikyu to always deal with... Uh, Gyarados and and put to an extent Gallade as well. I know Gallade is banded on this one Perfect perfect. I get a Brox Pretty positive this mon's choice band so I'm gonna bring out my uh, Tyranitar here and start going for game <laughs> Yeah, I'm like almost positive All right, so they go as elf Believe if I Dragon Dance up again, I win so I'm gonna Dragon Dance up again because they only have Bullet Punch on Lucario. Which definitely won't kill me. And then basically by going plus two, I for sure knock out their Tyranitar with Stone Edge. And then I Terra Blast and beat everything else. I'm going for this. I'm getting greedy. This is a Tyranitar Thunderous Showdown Live. I'm going to get greedy. I'm going to get so greedy. Especially if they want to go for Taunt this turn. Oh, Taunt this turn would be the... Woof! That'd be beautiful. That'd be beautiful. Let's see. If they go right for Taunt, perfect. So I actually get to pick up a KO here. With Crunch. I mean, they could Terra this. I don't know if it, whatever Terra they go to will live plus two. But yeah, I definitely want the plus two. This looks like his game. I could be wrong though. But if I Terra Fly, I, I know I knock out Gallade. I know I can Terra Blast everything. I Terra Blast Gyarados for sure, if that comes out. Again, the only Mon that uh, I need to be worried about is Tyranitar because that's the only Mon that I have to hit Stone Edge on. They may Terra Fly here, to be honest, and then click Earthquake as well. So if they do that and I miss, I'm okay with that. Let's see if they Terra Fly as well. Yep, yep, yep. I missed. Let's see if... All right. I mean, best case scenario, right? Because now I just uh, win the game with Terra Blast. We know they're banded. <laughs> we know they're banded, and now they lose. For sure. Because after the next Stealth Rock switch, they'll be taking 25% because they're a Flying type. So they just lose. I just click Terra Blast forever now, and I win. This game. What a great turn. What a great turn. Uh, this was like part of the reason why I didn't want to like Earthquake is obviously great on Tyranitar, but Terra Blast Fly is so nice. I mean, being able to resist first impression from Slitherwing and obviously just being able to smash basically every Mon. 
Like, you're in such a good position. All right, goodbye. Sorry, bud, you're not faster than me. I'm just barely slower than a Scarf Jirachi, which is a lot faster than you. So we'll knock out the Rotom with Crunch. Also, look at their, I love their DBP team. <laughs> if it had like Dragonite or Jirachi, it'd be perfect. It'd actually be perfect as the last one. Dragonite would actually make the most sense, even Flygon. Um, yeah, this is Scarf Rotom. And uh, this is Life Orb and, and everything. This should be game. Look at Big Titar. Guys, you got to live a light through Titar. Imagine this Mon being in RU. The disrespect. The absolute disrespect on this guy. Anyway, I want to share that replay. Even though I'm at a thousand on the ladder. I'm just I just want to tell him this tier's fire. Fire tier. Alright, let me get a, let me get a get another game real quick. Keep laddering up with our big teats are. We'll we'll be right back. I don't like their team at all because they have a Murkrow and that's very scary. And revival blessing spam. I'm leading over Azov. <laughs> I'm I'm terrified here. Honestly, uh, again, huge threat is Deancey in this game. I can tear a steel though. This game got some threats, bro. Kaparaja, I'm just gonna flame if they want to get up rocks or go out to Espeon. That's fine by me. Um, I just, I'm always. This is like my favorite Azelf set throughout every generation. Besides Life Orb, at that one point where people were running Lumberry Machamp, that was my favorite one. But besides that, like I, I absolutely love this. If they get up rocks, I'll click rocks in the following turn because who cares if they go Espeon at that point? There, we'll get a Brox here. Because if they go Espeon, then let me boom. I'm okay with that too. Also, Espeon setup fodder. Perfect. Hmm. Stone Edge. Based on that flamethrower from 286. I mean, obviously, Focus Blast kills, right? I'm just trying to think if, if, Thunder, if, if Thunderbolt does. Because this one's strong as hell. Man, I'm trying to see some damage. That did 286. It's super effective. I just want to see some. I just want to see some damn damage. I need this mon too. This mon is like my best mon in this tier, in this game. Yeah, that did zero. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I, I was like, wait, body press? Wait, no, body slam. <laughs> you kidding me, bro? Yeah, but if I focus last and missed, I got nothing out of the turn, and I got crit that turn. So, jeez, man. That much weaker? I know it's super effective, but jeez. That much weaker? Come on, bud. The good thing is, it doesn't matter if they get up rocks. I can always switch back and forth. Obviously, Azelf is whatever to me. Because um, I always go Tyranitar on that. I might run Terra Blast. I think I'm going to run Terra Blast Ground. Just because Deancey is a, a big problem to this team. Like a really big problem to this team. So I'm going to do that. This is how you, That's how you actually figure out you know, if you like teams or not, right? Jeez. Are you going to Drain Punch me? I know I'm about, I'm about to get energy ball, aren't I? Whatever's about to happen is about to hurt. That's all I know. But like, Tyranitar goes crazy this game. Tyranitar goes crazy this live. We already have Azov in range of plus two. That was like the honest play of all time. Like, and I said honest, not honest. Like that was an un, a super un play. I think even if they tear a fairy here, they die. Ooh, they went to Murkrow, which literally can't touch me because it has Prankster and I'm a dark type. I will obviously take this. You got me. I'm going to drag this up again. Hopefully they try and taunt or do something that doesn't work. Dude, I'm very weak to DNC. I got to be careful, man. And also giving it a Sandstorm special defense boost is really, really scary. It's very scary. Though at the same time, I'm pretty sure SD Mimikyu just smokes them. Doesn't work, bud. Okay, cool. You could have literally went for another Haze and, and been in the same position, but yeah. I feel like that's the hardest thing for people getting back into Pokemon to remember that Prankster moves don't work anymore on Dark types. And big shout out to both Thunderous and obviously Lifehard in that scenario for making that happen. Like, it's crazy. Thunderous, uh, Thunderous was the reason Thunder Wave got nerfed. Electro types are immune to Thunder Wave. Confusion from Swagger. It's, it's literally this Pokemon and Lifehard that made the Prankster changes happen. And a bunch of other ones. Ooh, those are Pokemon I haven't seen before. Let's go ahead and get them up. No, you will not be getting anything up, Sir Earthworm. Also, a whole team outsped. Besides one by this. So, get up my rocks here. A Metal Burst, I'm okay with that. As long as it's two KOs. Oh, and they didn't even Metal Burst there, so they didn't even bring me down to my sash. That's awesome. Alright, so we get rid of Earthworm. Amazing for Tyranitar, even if they save it. 
Titar looks very, very, very good here. Except for, I guess, Crocodile, but... Okay, Meloctro comes out. Thunderbolts. Oh, Terra Blast Ground is really nice, too. Maybe instead of using my Titar to win... I, uh, I just Dragon Dance up and use it to weaken thing. <laughs> All the in narration. <laughs> nah, dude, we go, we go, we go. I'm gonna talk to me in the chat. Um, anyway, instead of using this to win, I'm gonna use Jug to win, so I need to use this to weaken. So we'll just crunch here. Get a bunch of chip on the Crocodile. Nice little defense drop, or defense drop as well. You know what, let me, let me go to you. Yeah, on the Earthquake. Let me, I might as well just explode and get some damage. You know what I'm saying? That was Max Attack Explosion. I put Terra Normal on this boy too, so I can get some real damage. And we'll bring out my Thunderous, just in case they want to go Kilowattro, or they go Grafiai. It only can knock me out with Low Kick. I'll go for a nice little Crunch. It does not work. I'm a Dark-type. This is amazing, because this is one of the few things actually stopping me from using Mimikyu. And another person has, once again, forfeited after messing up versus dark types maybe that's why that model will eventually be banned okay cool team uh very anti-offense because for sturdy pokemon and things like that mellow what i'm sure it's gonna relic oh it's actually scarf wow we'll just flamethrower you t spike would be annoying but regular spike is not so perfect i get rid of one of the sturdy mons mimikyu is very very scary I will admit that Mimikyu is very scary. So scary to the point that I'm almost tempted to Terra Normal and Flamethrower to break its stuff. I'm actually really tempted here because I think I, be I can beat their team with Ditto anyway. I'm doing this. This is a really... I'm doing this. You will not Shadow Sneak me. Yeah, I will bust your disguise. Yeah, this is, uh, this is just so I don't have to deal with that disguise later. Because I'm running offense, right? I know it might look very stupid because it was. But you got to remember, it was. It's very stupid. I, I wanted to bust the disguise without dying. Hey, that's my homie's win. I could technically save this to explode on Mew. Hmm. Tyranitar's useless in the game. Yeah, Tyranitar's straight up useless. I don't like it as much in this one. Okay. I'm gonna go Thunderous now because it's faster than the entire team. Click that nice little Thunderbolt. Perfect. So I got rid of the two anti-offense mons, Sturdy Fortress, uh, because it would live a hit always. And obviously Mimikyu is very important to get rid of too. They psychic me with their scarf set. Now we can bring out Jug, and they have absolutely no switchins. I went for fire. I went for fire blast because I thought, you know, <laughs> the hair across, the resist. But I'm completely fine with this too. Again, by having Mimikyu in the back, I'm, I'm always good versus offense. By having my one explosion mon, I'm always good too. And they give me Mew there. Perfect. Don't think Heracross can even knock me out in one hit. You definitely can't knock me out in one hit. Unless you're like Terra Ice Ice Fan. No, not even Terra Ice Ice Fan will win. Dragon Dance doesn't help them in the slightest. I 2 a KO'd them anyway, so the crit. I get double crit. But yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Like this this Mon, Dark types are just the kings. Dark type, that's why Crocodile number one in Aryu. Or was. Now, enter these two Dark types. All right. Uh, sun freaking Stall looks crazy. <laughs> that looks insane. Free Stealth Rock though into Boom, which I'm very happy about. I mean, this works out as well, yeah. Free Stealth Rock into Boom. Uh, Aloe could come out. I would love to Terra Normal and just blow something up, but that's not the play. The Florius is probably going to be the biggest threat. I think Florius is going to be the biggest threat, but I do think that Terra Fly, Tyranitar looks really good. And also, I mean, I guess technically Nasty Plot Thunderous looks stupid good in this game too. But yeah, something has to come in and take Explosion. If I'm them, I go Alamola. One second. All right, great play on my opponent's part to go that. Now, what I want to do is I'm going to use this to weaken Florgus. So I'm going to Nasty Plot up here with Thunderous to weaken Florgus. And that will allow me to hopefully win later with Jugulus. That's basically what I'm going for, the Jugulus endgame. Because this is going to get a 2 KO on Florgus. What the hell? Dude, are you serious? Thunderous, what are you doing, bud? What are you doing, bud? I need you, bro. I need you to do some damage. But this is the only one I get to kill. Oh my god, and they're draining kiss too. <laughs> bro, Thunderous is so freaking weak. Whatever. 
I didn't want to Terra here, but I'm going to do it. This is not, it's so not the play. Oh my god, it's not the play. But I'm going to do it. Because I need to do some damage. 43, stop doing 43, bro. Stop doing 43. Not the Terra into instant death. Just get the Para already. I hit them with so many Thunderbolts. Bro, bro. Have they caught my max special defense? Uh-oh, uh-oh. I already know how that works. I get the crit right here. Sorry. Sorry, I get the crit right here. Yeah, or the kill. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go, baby. We take those. All right, giant threat gone. Going to take another one from them right now, too. So the sun's going to be gone. Torkoal opens up Mimikyu. Obviously, I can keep Thunderous alive. The Brute Bonnet gum out. Oh, God. Can't Terra no more, so I'm just going to go out to Tyranitar. Change this weather. Get rid of your Protosynthesis boost. You little demon. Get some Stone Edge damage off and call it a day. Yep, knock me out with your CC. Yep, yep. Can't do crap about that. <laughs> hmm. This seems more fun to do. Just CC here. I don't care if they go Aloe because I have Thundy. It comes right out. Yeah, perfect. We CC there. I don't care about Gyarados either. So the wing. I'll beat. 1v1. Mimikyu is better to keep. All right, we're going to Mimikyu on their U-turn. Oh, they went for first impression. That means I get a free Swords Dance. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Very good. Actually, I double. Because they're going to go Thunderous. I mean, Alan Mola, excuse me. Yep. Get a nice little Thunderbolt off. I don't know what Terra they're running on Alan Mola, but... It could be Terra Fairy. They can't kill me, though, is the thing. Nice. Get my beautiful damage off on that mon too. I don't need mimic you at all, but it will live a hit. I might as well SD now, because they're going to go Aloe anyway. They went Gyarados, which is not the play. Especially because they don't have uh, Mox, uh, Intimidate. So I can actually knock them out with plus two Shadow Claw, or make it very close. Yeah, that Terra, I don't know what they expected from me. That's a Terra, you're supposed to do that in front of Thunderous. Not, not in front of the mon that's already plus two. <laughs> not, not in front of that one. Dude, Florgus is a damn threat. I'm glad I was Terra Steel, but damn, Florgus is a threat. I'm glad this team doesn't have Florgus. Holy crap. Um, threat, 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 threat. The team. Insane team on our opponent's side. I'm just going to go for Taunt there as they go that Mon. I can easily explode. I'm just going to go for this, though, just in case. As they, I, I, I kind of had a feeling they'd be a Jack, but I'm glad we get rid of that. And then we just explode here because you're not the other one. We know you're not max speed either. Hmm. I'm trying to think the best way to do this. Also, they're flash fire. They weren't weak armor. Flamethrower plus grass move. Shouldn't be able to knock me out. I'm going to drag this up. They'll do a good chunk. Don't get me wrong. I'm trying to win this game with Endgame Mimikyu, by the way. Like, if you couldn't tell. I think I Terra and Dragoness again. God, Raging Bull did so much. They went for the right... They, they expected me to go Mimikyu, obviously. And now they're going to first impression. Which is fine. I, I missed my Lumberry. But that's fine. I got rid of this giant threat. Go ahead and first impression me. Nasty plot into Espeon. Then this forces two sacks from my opponent, which is why I nasty plotted. Also, I beat them back with flamethrower spam of my own, so. Don't have to click focus blast. They tear out and terra blasted. That's cool. You know you get <laughs> Thanks. They don't have enough Pokemon left to win. They do not have enough Pokemon left to win. Oh, and the fact that I lived actually makes it even harder for them now. Because now, yeah, they're locked into one Mon, and it can't win the game at all. Yeah, the fact that I live that is crazy, by the way. why you... Dude, Jugulus is so wild. Jugulus is so, so freaking wild. That was that was Protosynthesis boosted. I think that was Choice Man. You can't just run two Tyranitars and a Dugtrio with Sandvale. Or Sandforce. Probably Sandforce. Sandforce makes your sense. 
I freaking love this team for my opponent, though. How dare you do this? I love when I'm paralyzed, but my Pokemon doesn't know it. You feel me? You got y'all know what I'm saying? Like when you're paralyzed, but your damn mon doesn't know it, it's freaking amazing. Alright, don't be low kick. So I can ignore you. Get my big chip off on the chilling water, that's fine. Dragon is up again, as they wish, and they're forced to protect. I can at least go thunderous now. Nasty plot up on Tarantar. And destroy it with Grass Knot because I'm definitely not clicking Focus Blaster. You ain't you ain't living this. Look, man, that mod's good, but it's not that good. And then go Duck Shrill on Matera and knock this thing out with my baby, my baby little Grass Knot. If they Earthquake here. Okay, thank God they didn't Earthquake. I thought I thought Earthquake was about to come out. I was about to be... I, I was about to scream. If Earthquake came out, I was about to scream. Should keep you... Uh, because you're good, and they're gonna CC here anyway. I'm not going Mimikyu. I'll just go Tarantar. Oh my god, I look like a god. Let's crunch again. Dragon Dance up again. I'm basically just trying to, uh, to get a free switch into Thunderous to click my attack on it. Because Thundy goes crazy. I'm gonna focus blast just in case they don't. Wish. They should always wish past the Galib, but if they're crazy and go Iron Thorns, exactly. Like if I land focus blast, it dies. So yeah, exactly. Like they should have always went Galib. When you nasty fly like that, I don't get it. What don't you get? You made the wrong play. Always the play. Galib was always the play. It doesn't die. It doesn't die. I called you making the wrong play and focus blasted because it was low risk. That's it. Like, that's it. I don't I, I Hopefully they understand it now. I'm not even trying to be like, I, I hope they understand it now. That's just it. What's just it? <laughs> I'm up 5-4. <laughs> You're the one. It was, it was a low risk. It was low risk, high reward versus no risk, no reward. What's, if it's just thunder, like, 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 like if I T-Bowl, you just get that and then you can do that. This, whatever, do whatever you want. <laughs> You're good. I predicting you to predict the bad play. I did predict the bad play. <laughs> you to predict the right play over predicting I freaking hate the word over predicting that is uh, yes yeah yes yes uh, now we're having a little lesson here that's fine I freaking hate the word over predicting because that's just a damn post com word that we use back in the day when we we either played really poorly or we just straight out got it predicted like that's just it like as you learn risk management and all that stuff it's just Hold up, but it doesn't make sense. Maybe I just have bad luck with who I get matched with. Yeah, when you're playing PokeMMD. <laughs> Watch the live narration when I upload it tomorrow. I, I I didn't make any wrong play. Just blow through lower ladders with brain dead plays. Yeah, I'm PokeMMD. And you're being crushed live. <laughs> Aim wouldn't respond this way. Oh no. Okay, if you say so. If you say so. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, this is not even a problem. Just wish pass always. Leaf play is a wild play. Dude, this thing banded? Surely it is, right? Oh, he's baiting me to Focus Blast. Oh, but I want to do it so bad. I want to do it so bad. 
But that's such a choke. I'm going mimic you. It's such a choke to go for that. Psychic? Whoa, what did that even hit? What is this set? Psychic? Psychic is wild. Anyway, I save uh, I save this mod that way they can't take it sword spam. Versus me and go hard thunderous. It's always the play. Yeah, don't don't say aim wouldn't respond that way. I'm I'm literally aim. Like I I I would. I say exactly what I'm thinking. Jeez, I'm assuming. I mean, I know you're banded, right? You did that billion percent to Aloe. But I guess I might as well find out. Terra Water. Aqua Cutter. That is so cool. Wait, they just let me Leaf Blade them. <laughs> oh, okay, 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 okay. Cool. That's so freaking cool. That is legitimately so freaking cool. They lose uh, right now, but that's still really cool. That is very, 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 very cool. <laughs> Good game. Aim would respond this way. It'll be the last game in my life tomorrow. <laughs> I, I was giving you the, I was giving you the honest play. Anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed. Leave a like. Check out the team. It's on my website, Pogan.com. I'm probably about to say I was your biggest fan and then I, I don't like this, blah, blah, blah. I'm being just straight up truthful. I was giving him, I literally did. I literally predicted the bad play and he made it. This set is freaking cool though. Aqua Cutter, I, I, I love the Galate set. I'll see y'all in the next one though. Peace.